Hey guys, I am going to show you how I strip my diapers. First of all, I can tell I need to strip them because they're starting to leak a little bit and have a little bit of odor even after they've been washed. And um, the ones on this side, have they're wet right now. I just washed them and these have been cleaned and dried and everything. But I'm going to just do them all together. They're in the tub and I'm going to run hot water on them and um, put some rocking green in there. Okay, so I ran the hot water and I have a tub of some rocking green and I'm going to put about four to five tablespoons in here and I'm just going to sprinkle it over top of all the diapers. I am currently boiling four pots of hot water as well to add into here. Let's do one more because it's been a while since I stripped my diapers. You can see like that one right there, that insert's pretty dirty. That, that'll come pretty clean afterwards. But now that I put the rocking grain in, I'm just going to give it a little swish and agitate them a little bit. Um, get it all worked in before I add that really hot water. Okay, so I just added all the boiling water to this water. So it's really hot now, too hot to touch so I just have this wooden dowel and I use this and you kind of just swish around the diapers give them a little stir and I do this every once in a while just to kind of make sure that they're getting agitated and that they're getting um the soap's going to get worked into them um and I it depends on how badly they need a soak how or how long I actually have to do this I usually let them sit for 24 hours um just because but I might only do like six hours today. We'll see what I feel like. But you can see I have my, that's my wet bag in there. And I put all the inserts, the shells, and the wipes all in the same tub. So that is what I'm doing today. Okay, guys. So I'm draining the water in here now. The diapers have been in for, oh, I'd say about 13 hours now. So um, I don't really wring them out because I want them nice and heavy and I just have this big tub here and I'm going to dump them in there. And then I'm going to bring them down to the laundry room. And basically what I do after this is I just wash them like I normally would except without detergent. And then I do a rinse and a rinse and a rinse and a rinse until there's no more suds. Um, and then I would dry them normally or you can sun them. Um, I need to get a rack so I can sun my diapers. But they're all in here. They're all clean, but I am going to run them through the wash. Um, you can see they're pretty white on the inside. Um, some of them have a little bit of staining. You can't really see them. But anyway, I'll just run them through the wash and then, like I said, rinse, 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 rinse until there's no more suds left in the water. And yeah, that's it for the soak part. Okay guys, last part of my day for the stripping the diapers is I toss my diaper pail right in the tub and I clean it, bleach it, do whatever. I do this every time I wash the diapers because you don't want it to get stinky, but Figured I'd show you, since I'm showing my routine of it, that I'd just show you the last part. And if it was the daytime, I'd go ahead and set it outside open. I would just open the lid here and I would just let it air out outside for a little while. But it's good. It's clean. It smells nice finally again. So that's all, guys.